I started One Free World International for Human Rights. It's a human rights organization to defend the freedom of religion, defend the persecuted Christians, defend the other minorities that are facing persecution for their beliefs, no matter who they are, such as the Muslim Baha'is or the, the Muslim Ahmadis or the Falun Gong or the Uyghurs, the Muslims in China, or standing against anti-Semitism. We stand for the freedom of religion everywhere. I've been a freedom fighter since I was 18 years old. I've been fighting uh, to defend the people that are facing persecution for their belief uh, for the last 15 years or more right now. The persecution that's happening to these people is not something that I'm not familiar with. The main reason why I'm very passionate about it because I'm one of them. I used to be one of them. Between 200 to 300 million persecuted Christians in our world today, and nobody mentioned anything. You, you can speak about the persecution of any other minority, and the media will listen, the people will listen, but when you come to the persecuted Christians, nobody will listen. And I don't know why. When you hear persecution of Christians, you think it, it, it's something that happened in, in the early church years. I mean, immediately after the crucifixion of Christ, there was a lot of persecution. But actually, there's more persecution of Christians today than there was back then. So people need to, to know that. And not only to know it, but to care about it. Somebody need to fight for these people. With my old respect, since the existence of this law is not used anywhere but in personal disputes. Uh, I'm looking at Iran as an example for democracy. And I'm looking for Iran. The deadly bomb blast in August 28, 2012 in Druze and Christian areas the arrest of many of the Christians and other minorities and torturing them on the hand of the rebels. Not focusing on dealing with the source of the problem and, uh, and, and the roots of the problem, which is fighting ISIS and our military mission. If there is a... This freedom cannot be complete without the power of women in the society. We are the future of this land. And I know that uh, it's a very hard land to be a female. But uh, you are not, but you are not alone. And we're coming all the way from Canada and the United States to tell you that we love you, we are proud of you, and the future, you are the future of this land. Oh, as right, Monsieur. We know for the last two years, we've been working with the Afghan authority and for, with the Canadians about your case. Well, no. 
ما هر ضريبة خدا The only way to get out of this issue is by killing me. They can always kill the dreamer, but no one can kill the dreamer.